With the shades on. You my main chick. Rock my back. Oh, yes, it feels so good. Yes, it feels so freaking good. Whew, you my main mama. Hey. Hey, hey. Okay. So today's video Ooh. is the up blah 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 blah. Ooh, I'm always I feel like no, I don't feel like I know. I'm always wearing this shirt. And it's because it's just like my absolute favorite. I got it when around the time that we were gonna go to Chicago. It just still fits me and like the material is so so comfortable and I just absolutely love wearing it. Oh, huh. I wash it every single day. I do laundry every day. I know that's weird but to some people, but I just like to do laundry every day because I don't like for it to like pile up. I apologize for my nipples. They're out there. I mean they're always out there, you know. But you guys if you follow our family channel you know why they're always out there. Well because I've had problems. And I can't wear underwire bras, so I just wear like these flimsy bras that like show everything so i don't know i try to come with terms with the fact that like my nipples are gonna always be out there and showing and it sucks but it doesn't suck you know what i mean like but i wish i was just more comfortable with it and i tried to be i think i am pretty comfortable with it maybe i just feel like complaining right now this was not supposed to be a mukbang <laughs> why do i talk so much before i actually start the actual video that i'm supposed to be doing but I guess it kind of turned into a mukbang because I'm hungry. Mm. I'm eating a donut. Mm. And some egg whites with a vegan hot dog and some raw broccoli. Oh. Okay, so today's video is Somehow my videos always turn into mukbangs, but Hi dog, we love you So today's video is um, oh my god, I need some water Oh my nose it is Okay, I'll be right Okay, okay, I'll get to the point, okay? Today's video is about, well not about, but in today's video, we'll be telling you baby names that I personally, these are all my names, okay? Because if Martin wants to tell y'all the names that he likes, then I don't know, he can do that. <laughs> I mean, this channel is called Our Mommy for a reason, right? So these are all names that I personally, myself, like, but will not be using. Um, so let's get started. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> you want my mama. I'll start off with boy names that I absolutely love but will not be using this time around, okay? My first name is Cristiano. I absolutely love the name Cristiano, but the reason why we're not using it this time around is because our dog's name, little Ronaldo, Ronnie, Ron, he was named after Cristiano Ronaldo, the soccer player. And so we're like, okay, if we have a boy, how are we going to name him? you know, after Cristiano Ronaldo too. Then it'll just be two of our sons named after Cristiano Ronaldo and then that's just like too much, you know? So we're not gonna be using Cristiano, but I do really like that name. That name's rich. Oh, my phone is lying. Okay. okay, the second name that I love is Kyrie. I like that name. The next name I like is Loke Lan. But I only kind of like that name. I don't like that name, like love that name. I just kind of like it. Martin's calling. Hi, Debbie. What up, Chile? What are you doing? What Chile doing? Our video. How are you? Yeah. Oh. Names. 
I love, but will names I love but will not be using. Okay, I love see you by love. Okay. okay, let's get back to it. So Lokeland. I like the name Lokeland, but I don't love it. I'm just like kind of like it, so I definitely won't be using it. Okay, I really love this name, Xander. Can you hear me? I really love this name, Xander. I just really, really like it. Um, the Mason's middle name is actually Alex Xander. So I was thinking that would be kind of cool, like Xander for the baby's first name. I don't know what the middle name would be that goes with that Mason. <laughs> Xander Mason, <laughs> we're just switching, I'm kidding. But I don't know, I really like that name, Xander. It's almost like short for Alexander, you know? Anyways, next name I like is Olin. I really, really like that name, Olin. I think it's different. Okay, the next name I like is Drake Atlas. And the only reason why I'm not using it is because, well, obviously, like, there's the rapper Drake, and everybody's gonna be like, oh, you're copying Drake. I was kind of way I would be. I like that name, Drake Atlas. Why do I keep stuffing whole broccoli in my mouth like I like it? I'm gonna take it slowly. This next name is different. Tage. Something different, it's short. T A J. Next name I like is Elias. Now I really like this name, Elias. I like it because two things. I feel like you can say it in English and you can say it in Spanish. Elias Eli Elias. Elias Elias. But, I don't know. I don't think we're going to be using that name. Things could change, right? But I don't know. No, I don't think so. Ooh, the next name I have on here, I cannot say because this is like our name. Like this name, we absolutely freaking love so much. Um, it's been at the top of our list for a very long time now, even before we knew we were expecting. We just really like this name. And the craziest part about this name is that I asked Mason, if you have a brother, what do you want to name him? And he by himself chose this name with another name that I can't tell you guys. So it just felt like it was meant to be, you know? So anyways, I can't tell you. But I almost did. Okay, the next name is Osman. I really like that name Osman, it's different. Osman, Osman. The next name is Alessandro. It's different, I like it. It's kind of got like an Italian kick to it. And some of you guys might not know this, but I have a little bit of Italian in me from my dad's side, so I don't know, I thought it was pretty cool. Okay, so is that everything for boy names? I actually really liked the name Jackson before we got our dog Jackson. And we got Jackson, our German Shepherd, from my cousin and I remember, I had more names, but I can't, oh, I have two. So Jackson is another one that we absolutely loved. And when we got Jackson from my cousin, because he was my cousin's dog first, and we found out that she named him Jackson, we're like, okay, well, there's no way ever we could use that name now. And um, the other name is Grayson. I love that name, Grayson. I also like the name Gray for like a middle name for sure. For short. Obviously, it wouldn't be Grayson Gray. But like separately, Gray could go with another name, you know? I'm gonna turn this off. But yeah, Grayson and Jackson, those would be my last two. I feel like I had other names, but I cannot think about it right now. I have always, I always text Martin like random names that I love. So anyways, moving on to girl names now. First one is Leilani. I think that name is so cute. I remember being friends with a girl, or not like friends, but like talking to a girl in my class when I was in junior high, and she was so freaking sweet. Like everything about her, her mannerisms, she was just so kind, and I don't know, she kind of looked like she was Hawaiian to me, and I remember she would wear like a flower right here, and I don't know, I just really, really, really love that name, and I reference it back to some, you know, something positive in my life, which was this really sweet girl that was once in my class. Leilani, I like that name. The next name is Vivian. I think that, that's, that's got like a little kick to it, you know, like Vivian. The next name is Zara. I love that name. As you guys know, there's a clothing company called Zara, and I just feel like it's, it's different. You don't really hear that name. 
So she's probably going to be like a fashion stylist or something, but I just really, really like that name. The next name is Zaylee. Zaylee's different. Um, recently I found out that Mason knows somebody with this name, so we're not gonna be, definitely not using that one, Zaylee. The next name is Malia. I, I like names that end with A, but also names that end with et, not just because my name says that. I don't know, it's just names that end with A and names that end with et. I think they, they sound a little fierce, like they got a little something to them, you know? Sorry, I get so distracted when people like, you know, when they walk in front of the house. Okay, the next name is Alessandra. So sort of like Alessandro, Alessandra, you know, has that Italian kick to it, that Italian feel to it. I like it, Alessandro, Alessandra. Next name is Alessia. It's different, Alessia. I think it sort of has like that Spanish, but also Italian kick to it. Next name is Catalina. I love this name so much. So much, so much so that Martin used to like a girl I think named Catalina, was it? Yeah, Catalina and I don't even care, like I really like this name, Catalina. So I don't think we're going to use it this time around, but maybe with one of our future baby girls. Okay, so next name is Selena. Martin doesn't like it, he's not a fan of it. I'm like, anything for Selena, wouldn't that be cute? We could reference her back to the movie. He's like, mm, no. Next name is, we both really like this name, but mm, I, don't, I don't know if we're going to use it. Camila. <laughs> I love that name. I think that name's so, so, so pretty. Camila. It reminds me of a Brazilian girl from this, this show we are obsessed with the challenge because her name is Camila. And I might have gotten the name from her, actually. I'm not really sure, but I really like that name. Next name is Zalia. I love the name Zalia. It's pronounced Z. It's it's spelled a little bit differently, but it's Zalia. Zalia. I think that's cute, right? And the last but not least, I'm really hesitant to say this name because seriously, like, I feel like I would use this name if it's a baby girl. I don't feel like I should say it, but it's not number one. It's number two. Should I say it? I think I'm gonna say it because Mason told me I'm not allowed to use the name because he said somebody in his classroom is named this. And it's true, I got it from the, his, the little girl in his classroom. I just think she's so freaking cute. She's so adorable and I absolutely love her name. But we're not gonna use it because Mason's like, no, that's weird. He absolutely doesn't like it. And so eventually I'll use it though. <laughs> so the name is Evelette. I love that name. Isn't it beautiful, Evelette? Evelette, Evelette, and it matches with her mom, Suzette. <laughs> Is it you know Evelette? No, it's not because even if it's a girl, this time around, we will not be using the name Evelette. So Evelette and Catalina are two of my highest ranked names that um, if I have, you know, if not other than this baby, if I have more girls later on, I will definitely be using at least one of those names. So. I like them. Mm. Okay, Evelette. I totally like that name. I really like that name. But we have a number one name for a girl. I absolutely love to. Um, we actually got her name off a Spanish song. I really like Spanish, kind of Italian sounding names for, for girls. I really, really like it. Not so much for boys. I don't know why I don't really like, I found that I don't really like too many Spanish names for boys, but for girls I do. So all my boys will have like American names and all my girls will have like straight up Latina names. <laughs> Anyways guys, that's it. I'm gonna end the video. Hopefully I can get this video up now and I don't have to edit too much from it. Mm. Bye. Oh, real quick, I will be uploading my 30 week mukbang update video. Sorry, something about the egg made me nauseous right now. But, um, mm. look out for that. I've been meaning to post it up and I'm just a little late. 30 week update video coming soon.